guys so it's that time of month again it is March no April 5th I am getting my months and days all mixed up um, I am a mess but what's new <laughs> um, all my videos I start I start out as a mess and let's so sit down video because then I'm prepared for it but anyways it is the fifth I went to Costco yesterday and I just went to food line this morning to finish up my shopping this is a totally different shopping haul grocery haul than you guys are probably gonna be used to on my channel I usually shop for one month I do a lot of Costco shopping and then I do Walmart or I've been doing sharp shoppers but Sharp Shoppers is totally worth it, um, but when it's like two and a half hours away and you have to take all the kids and stuff, then it gets a little tiring and huh, yeah, I can't do that every month. But this month, like I said, it is April 5th. Johnny and I are leaving for vacation on April 10th, which is this Sunday. It's Tuesday. I'm going to post this video today, the same day. Um, so what I did was I kind of grocery shopped for the month. And I kind of didn't. So I have like my chicken that'll last me the month, a couple extra meals. Most likely I'll have to do a little bit more grocery shopping when I get home from vacation. Um, but I did monthly slash weekly grocery shopping. So I have stuff for this week and then I have stuff for the month too. So I split it up. I have just a few things from Costco and then I have the rest of my stuff from Food Lion. And yeah, I will show you what I got. I spent $90 I think. I spent a little bit more because Food Lion's a little bit more expensive and Costco wasn't having very good sales. So I spent, okay, hold on. I spent, um, sorry, Kevin needs a baby wipe. <laughs> um, I spent probably, I think I spent 50 at Costco and then 50 at Food Lion. So like a hundred, I would say a hundred dollars altogether, um, for weekly slash monthly, which is not my best. Like I said, Costco was just not having any good sales when I went. Um, the sale for the month didn't start until April 7th. So I'm thinking it was like just in between the two months and yeah. Um, and then like I said, Food Line, normally not the place I want to shop. They're really expensive. Um, food, Walmart is like number one. I, normally I would do Costco and Walmart. But anyways, let me stop talking and dragging this out and show you this month April's grocery haul. Okay, so I'm going to start with Costco. Like I said, I barely got anything, but hey, what can you do? <laughs> um, the chicken pot pies were on sale for $3 off, so I paid $14 for that, 13 I can't remember, but it looked delicious and it's huge, so this could be like dinner plus leftovers. I got my normal six and a half pound bag of frozen boneless skinless chicken breast. I got this oven roasted turkey breast and this um, provolone cheese I thought would be good on these croissants. So I have a sandwich line up here. Um, these were $5.99. This was $6.39 I think and this was $11.44. But these croissants are just so soft and I was watching Brittany and Baby's um, toddler meal ideas I think or her what she eats when she's when she was pregnant or something like that and her croissants looked so good I saw one with like avocado and cheese and turkey and stuff like that so I did get avocado too but it looked delicious and I thought that would be a good lunch so I got that and then I got cinnamon toast crunch for the kids and then my normal giant case of water so that's what I got at Costco let's go over to <laughs> excuse me I'm sorry to food lion um I got two gallons of one percent milk I got the Alexa or Alexia sweet potato fries I decided to try these for me a little snack it's only 60 calories it's dark chocolate and it's strawberries and that sounded amazing um Four grams of fat, four grams of sugar, six carbs. So I figured that could be my little snack or sweet whenever I want a sweet. Um, I got this big bag of Normandy Blend frozen vegetables. This is delicious. 
I love squash and I love zucchini, so if you do, then try it, but this is my favorite. It has broccoli, cauliflower, sliced carrot, zucchini, and squash. It is delicious. Um, I got some pepper just because we needed some. We've been needing it for like three months. <laughs> um, I got some light mayo, some pineapple tidbits, some Spanish olives for Johnny, some roasted red peppers for... I think I did a recipe on it. Um, it was the flat bread or tortilla spinach chicken pizza. Um, Katie from Cullen and Katie did it on a cooking with Katie pie and it is by far the deliciousest, if that's a word, um, diet or low fat good pizza you can eat. It is really good. Um, I didn't think I was gonna like roasted red peppers, but like I said, it's delicious. They use dairy-free cheese, but I cannot find it anywhere because we don't have a Whole Foods or anything near us, so I just get this mozzarella cheese. I got some strawberry Pop-Tarts for the kids. I got one pack of this um, whole grain medley brown and wild rice mix. I got two of the regular whole grain brown rice. I got two of these frozen tricks strawberry banana yogurts for the kids. I got the Ritz Toasted Cheddar Chips. These um, Black Forest Fruit Snacks. I got two packs of mac and cheese. The kids absolutely love this mac and cheese and this is easy for like Wednesdays or Fridays. Those are normally our busiest days. Wednesdays we have church and Fridays we're always out so we need something quick. Um, so yeah, that's for them and I already have I don't think I told you guys but I do have a lot of stuff left left from last month if you remember my haul from last month was gigantic and I do have a lot of stuff left from last month so yeah I got six cans of the Starkist chunk light tuna in water okay let me tell you a story not a story but one two three four yeah six okay I went to Costco I wanted a big pack of tuna. Well, their Trunk Light Tuna, Kirkland's brand, there's an eight pack there and it is $13, I think, or $12. Um, this was like 85 cents a can. So for six, I only paid like five fifty, I think. So I don't understand. Like I could have got eight and paid like seven something for eight of them and it would have been cheaper. So Costco is not the place to get tuna. <laughs> Anyways, um, I got some ranch dressing for Johnny. I got a light raspberry vinaigrette for me. I got some organic honey. I've been drinking tea every night, and I love honey in my tea. Um, I got some barbecue sauce. I got the Sunbelt Bakery raspberry bars. I got some popcorn. The kids don't really eat a lot of popcorn. Um, I don't know. Actually, they probably had it like once, but I thought that would be a good snack for them. But it's a Smart Pop popcorn. And yeah, so I got that. <laughs> um, I got some organic Red Delicious apples. I got a sweet onion. Three avocados. Say hi, guys. Yeah, I get you some popcorn in a little bit, okay? Okay, I got five zucchini, I think. Um, I got two bunches of bananas. I got a big thing. I think this is a not a pound, ten ounces of organic baby spinach, and then I got a loaf of 100% whole wheat whole grain bread. I know, I know. Hold on, I'm coming. And then I got this flat out light Italian herb flatbread. This is what I'm going to make those chicken roasted pepper pizzas on. I hope you enjoyed this haul. If you did, give it a thumbs up and we will see you in our next video. Bye guys.